Every role-playing game worth its salt will tell a deep and intriguing story, and every story worth hearing will feature some kind of shocking plot twist that causes us to question everything we think we know about the characters we've grown to love. So integral is the plot twist to mainstream storytelling these days, every game and their sequel presents some sort of surprise intended to send players' jaws slamming to the floor. Some games twist and turn so often it's a miracle they don't tie themselves in a knot. We as players have become much more observant in our judgement of characters and events. The archetypal tropes that have held stories together for centuries have lost their edge. Even those of us who don't follow the Spider-Man comics could spot Martin Lee's evil intentions a mile off. Writers need to be far more subtle in their approach if they want to catch us off guard. We need to be hit by something that we genuinely didn't see coming. We've already listed our favourite shocking video game plot twists, but your suggestions in the comments were worthy of their own moment in the spotlight. I'm Jess for What Culture. here are 8 monumental video game plot twists nobody saw coming, commenter edition. Spoilers are ahead, so beware. Number 8, Nier Automata. It's true we've come to expect the odd twist in our video games. As we'll cover throughout this list, a good old stab in the back courtesy of a best friend is a common occurrence. It's just not always clear when and where they're going to strike. We don't have to worry about any of that in this game though, as this is more of an existential crisis. It's lucky that this is an enjoyable game to play, because the bombshell that everything you've done throughout is essentially a pointless endeavour driven by the ideals of two long extinct species provides a stiff slap in the face to those of us hoping to save the world. The androids and the robots have been fighting on behalf of humans and aliens respectively, relentlessly driven by orders given millennia ago, which have absolutely no relevance or meaning anymore. That's right, the meaning of life is to perpetuate this cycle of death just for the sake of it. The magnitude of this reveal is quite something. It comes right out of left field, and there's no doubt it leaves a lasting impact. Number 7, Final Fantasy VII. It's hard to imagine a time before this iconic and emotionally charged moment in video game history. Much like the saying goes that you're only two degrees of separation away from a celebrity, the same can be said about Aerith's death in Final Fantasy VII. It caused such a huge reaction at the time that it transcended the community of FF7 players to become a mainstream phenomenon. We'd seen deaths before in games, the FF series itself had killed off characters in the past, but we'd never seen anything of quite this magnitude. Aerith was different. Here we had this light-hearted and carefree girl who immediately struck a chord with players who seemingly had a central role to play as the story progressed. It looked for all the world that this would become the story of Cloud and Aerith in their battle against Sephiroth. But in one of the most famous scenes in gaming that would single-handedly ensure FF7's position in history, she would be murdered by Sephiroth in a shockingly brutal manner. The impact of Sephiroth's sword would send a shock wave that continues to resonate with players 20 years later. Number 6, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. How often have we seen the inspirational war hero betray their country in aid of some glorious quest for revenge or redemption? It's fair to say this is a fairly common occurrence in fictional warfare, and General Shepard is just one of many disloyal soldiers we've come across over the years. The moments surrounding Shepard's betrayal sparked substantial outcry among players at the time, because the manner of his actions was pretty horrific. The fact that we got to experience them in classic COD first person made them all the more impactful. After dutifully following Shepard's orders for the first half of the story, things take a striking turn as we're shot, beaten up, and stabbed by that treacherous scoundrel as we witness a number of beloved characters meet their ends by his hands. It's a double feeling of dismay as these events unfold. Firstly shock, but then exasperation as we wonder how we didn't see this coming. How has he got away with so much right under our nose? The fact that this guy had us running errands for him as he carries out his master plan is another level of sickening. Number 5, Metal Gear Solid 5: The Phantom Pain. The grand finale to a series so renowned for its convoluted plot lines promises to bring everything together to form a complete picture. All the gaps that had been left over 20 years of storytelling were set to be filled in. That was what we thought anyway. As it turned out, we were taken for fools as soon as we started a new game. Following on from the events of Ground Zeroes, Big Boss and his army are attacked by the Big Bad and his cronies and caught up in a catastrophic helicopter crash. From that moment on and the entirety of The Phantom Pain, we're led to believe we're playing as a disfigured Big Boss on the road to revenge against his enemies. How gullible we were! The ending reveals that we aren't Big Boss at all, 
were in fact a nameless medic who'd been riding on the same helicopter when it crashed. Our deeds in the Phantom Pain are nothing more than a decoy, while Big Boss is off doing something far more important. To top it all off, it's revealed that the real Big Boss was giving us the full moon during the entire opening sequence. Thanks, Kojima. Number 4. Infamous When Infamous first launched on PS3, it was a brand new IP, introducing an entirely new world and protagonist, Cole McGrath. It employed an interesting karma system, whereby choosing to act for the forces of good or evil would unlock a different branch of Cole's abilities, meaning the gameplay would be altered by your choices. Over the course of the game, the actions of prime bad guy Kessler are pretty shocking. He kills Cole's girlfriend Trish, and we're led to believe he oversaw the future destruction of the present day world we're jumping around in. It seems like this guy needs a good beating. But we find out towards the end of the game that Kessler is actually Cole from the future. After we beat him in the final showdown, it's revealed that he's traveled back in time to prepare his past self for a morbid future. So in his own roundabout way, he's trying to save himself and his future wife, in the process killing said wife and destroying vast areas of the city. It's an interesting strategy, but it was a twist we certainly did not see coming. Number 3. Assassin's Creed 3 the opening act of AC3 is brilliantly presented. It follows Haytham's exploits as he assassinates several bad guys and frees a group of Native Americans. It seems for all the world that this guy is another badass assassin with an arsenal of impressive skills and weapons. The Haytham section ends with an initiation of sorts, a new assassin joining the order. How exciting! Wait, what? Oh no, it turns out the entire two and a half hour chapter has been a ruse. One of the more tragic moments in Assassin's Creed 3 is when we learn that Haytham Kenway, with all his charm and charisma, is actually a member of the evil Templar organization that we've been trying so hard to eliminate. The rest of the game is presented from the viewpoint of Haytham's son Connor, whose story eventually sees us assassinate our old friend for the greater good as he refuses to back down on his Templar beliefs. Haytham's character is one the developers would bring back in AC4 Black Flag with Edward Kenway, who became one of the most popular characters in the franchise, but it was certainly an interesting choice to have us play as a Templar for the first time. Number 2. A Way Out With one of the more interesting twists we've come across, the two-player co-op game A Way Out sees you and a friend work together to break out of prison and avoid the pursuit of police and hitmen hired by an old accomplice turned enemy. The game is presented entirely in a split-screen format, and both players are tasked with collecting materials and looking out for each other throughout a journey that initially sees the two characters form a bond of friendship. The fact that you're actively experiencing this along with a friend makes it all the more endearing, but it works to ensure Vincent's eventual betrayal is a good hard kick in the proverbials. You don't just fall out with the character, you end up falling out with your friend as well. Having spent a good six hours working in harmony towards a common goal, it's revealed that it's actually all been an elaborate ruse, and that whoever was unlucky enough to have been playing as Leo had just been taken for a ride. It's hard to not take it personally, and the fact that both players are then pitched against each other in a shootout makes for one of the most impactful twists in gaming, and at least personally threatened to end one of my friendships. Number 1. Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic The Star Wars universe has a history of iconic and mind-blowing twists, and Knights of the Old Republic offered up a similarly shocking revelation when it's discovered that the main character is Darth Revan, a former Sith Lord suffering from amnesia after sustaining near-fatal injuries in a past battle. Over the course of the game, you take on the role of this unassuming soldier of the Republic as they embark on a journey, joining the Jedi Order and gradually developing their powers. You have the choice of acting on either the light or dark side of the Force, and there are inklings along the way that not all is well within Revan's mind. What we didn't expect, however, was for this Jedi Knight to be revealed as as the one-time antagonist Sith Lord Dark Revan, former friend and master of Darth Malak, the main antagonist of the game. As the details of this story were revealed during a confrontation between the two characters, we felt the impact along with Revan, as our existence within the game was thrown into doubt. The fact that fans still talk about this almost 20 years later tells you what a shocking moment it really was. I've been Just For What Culture. Thanks again for your comments that have created this commenter edition list, and make sure you stay tuned for plenty more content.